good morning one and all in this session we are going to learn about what is jsp and how can we interact jdbc from jsp so jsp is an advanced version of serverlets and using jsp we can develop an interactive web applications and moreover jsp will internally convert it into a servlet page so what jsp contains jsp consists of tags like declaration tag scriptlet tag and expression tag Declaration tag is used to declare the variables and scriptlet tag is used to represent the Java code in a JSP page. While retrieving the values, we are going to use an expression tag. So I quickly open my NetBeans IDE. So here in this program, I have imported the packages in a JSP page using a taglib directive. So here I have imported io.star, util.star, SQL package and servlet package. So every HTML page will internally written as a JSP page. So while writing a Java code in a JSP page, we are going to mention it in a scriptlet tag. So here I have written a code for JDBC connection using a Derby database. So here I have taken a database name as KBN and username as KBN and password as KBN. So in the database, I have created a table with a name called department. So here I am going to retrieve the values from a department from a JSP page and storing all the values into a table. So here I have created a table with a department number, department name and location. So here I have retrieved the values. While retrieving the values from database to JSP, we are going to use this expression tag. So that's why RS dot get int of one, get string of two and get string of three. So quickly I open my database so here this is my database I will connect to Java DB and I will open my KBN database so in KBN database it consists of tables which consists of values so here I am going to open my department table which consists of number of values now I will run the code so simply defaultly it will run index.html page Hence, I am going to mention the JSP name that is retrieve.jsp in the output. So the output is running. The Apache Tomcat server is started. So I am going to select my username and password. And I am going to make a retrieve. Dot JSP. So here it will retrieve all the value from the database and similarly we can retrieve based upon certain condition also that is here we go. So in this program I have written an HTML page and I am going to write a method called post and action equal to condition dot JSP while retrieving the values or while connecting from HTML to servlet we can simply mention the servlet name without any extension but for JSP we are going to mention it with an extension. So here enter department number to retrieve and here I have accepted one value and I have used a submit button. So while pressing the submit button, it will be navigated to condition.jsp page. So similarly, likewise, I have written the packages for io.star, util.star and sql.star and in try block, I have written the code for database connection. So here I have retrieved the value from the HTML page with the help of request.get parameter and the value is stored in VAL. So select star from table name where department number equal to VAL. That is here, here I have mentioned the condition with the values and using this I have retrieved the values. So similarly the JSP page is closed. So I will run the code here. So simply I will run condition.html. Here I am going to mention condition condition dot html so simply i am going to retrieve value i will mention 101 with the table name so i will get the department number which consists of values 101 values so in this way we can retrieve the values from jdbc into a jsp page based upon certain condition so this program represents the retrieving of complete values and this program will represent based upon certain condition so in this way we can interact JSP to 
Derby database. Thank you.